Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Nacho Dad, and today I'm out here uh, doing a little work in the shed. It's a mess. It's it's a mess. Like that's the only word I can describe it. I'm trying to do some cleaning, trying to do some organizing, and trying to buy some new stuff. So what we got here? This is a Duromax XP18 HPE. So it's an 18 horsepower, 440 cc electric start, big block. I won this engine at the Redbeard Garage Meetup this year. Uh, the last drawing of the day and he just happened to call my ticket and I was standing there I, I wasn't expecting to win but that's awesome big shout out to Redbeard's Garage for having the meetup that thing is always fun can't wait for the next one maybe can go do a little more trail riding get something a little better and uh, I guess shout out to Duramax for sponsoring that letting them do the giveaway because now I've got this awesome big block it's still sitting in the box it's been almost two months now it's still sitting in the box so we're going to unbox that today and also today went to the local Harbor Freight if you can see that 212 cc engine so I picked me up a Predator 212 open box 76.98 did a little talking with the manager he cut me an extra 20% off that because he's had it in the store so long I passed up buying this thing over a month ago when it had the 95 sticker on it I dropped it down to 76 did a little talking wound up getting it for like 59 or 60 dollars something like that not gonna pass it up for that so today we're gonna do a joint unboxing real quick I'm gonna pull these two out put them side by side and just show what the size difference is between the 212 and the 440 so hold on one second let me drop these out the box because I don't have a tripod for my phone right now all right so these are them sitting outside the boxes on the right the good old predator 212 on the left the 440 18 horse Duromax. Just a little bit bigger on the Duromax. This is just a side by side on the front covers. You can see the Duromax sits probably a good six inches taller. And it's probably every bit eight inches wider. This way. So this is just a uh, up front view. We'll go ahead and give them a turn. Nah, actually we'll turn it back. So this is everything that comes in the box with the Predator. You get the spark plug tool, the owner's manual and there's a quick start guide that comes on the engine and for the 18 horsepower electric start Duromax you get the key switch with circuit protection so you can wire it up two okay size battery cables keys spark plug tool and the bolt to put the key switch on the engine so nice little kit comes with the Duromax this is an EPA and CARB approved engine, so, you know, it's California emissions, but we'll deal with it, I think. Move all this stuff to the side. It's a uh, one inch impact that I found on the side of the road about a month ago. I passed that sucker on my way to work every day for a week, decided I'd stop and see if it was still good. Still good. Don't know what I'm going to do with it. All right, we're not going to start these today because I'm running low on time. Uh, let's see 30 weight so you can tell this thing's got the big electric start on it wire that in spin it on around here to the output side same with the 212 that's a size comparison of them on the back side this has got a three-quarter output shaft this has got a big one inch output shaft Ooh. Ugh, it's like they greased it together greasy so all right that's just a little preview of what I'm gonna be working on here what is that weird all right that's just a little size comparison for them you know, the 212 here is supposed to be six and a half horsepower, and this is 18 horsepower, so it's more than double the size, a little bit more than double the uh, CC, double the displacement. What you got here? This is your small block, your big block. All right, that's it. That's somebody says small block, they mean small block. 212, 196, you know, a couple other engines about that size. Then you got the big block. This is the GX390. The Predator 420s, the Duramax 440s. Yeah. Beefy. Now, I'm not going to start these up today. I don't have oil and I don't have time right now. But what we are going to do 
is uh, sometime this week come over here, bolt them down to the bench outside and fill them up with oil and do their break-in cycles and I'll try to film that. So, you know, just stay tuned. I'll have a video of both of these running. This one's probably going to go on the Coleman. The engine on it's fine, but for 50 bucks, I mean for a 212, I, I, yeah, I'll 212 it. The Duramax, I don't know what it's going to go on, but i got to find something. She's ready. Alright guys, that's it for this video. We'll catch y'all on the next one.